Well, the Taylor County Child Welfare Board is looking for people to help make miracles for children served by Child Protective Services this Christmas season. Here to tell us more and tell us about how you can help is Shanna Schaefer and Amy Bailey. Ladies, how are you today? Good, how are you? I'm good, thank you both for joining me so much today. So tell me a little bit about Miracle on Vine Street. Um, so the Taylor County Child Welfare Board does this every year and children that are served by CPS, children in emergency shelters, children in residential treatment facilities, and children placed in kinship placements, meaning they're placed with family members. We cover all of those kiddos and people in the community, businesses, um, can go and purchase gifts for these kiddos and drop them off and we wrap them and caseworkers deliver them and it really truly makes a child's Christmas. It's amazing. Absolutely. So you can be uh, different types of sponsors for this, right? You can do monetary as well as going out and doing a little bit of the shopping for these kids, right? Absolutely. We understand that not everybody likes to shop and we know that it's crazy out there during the holidays. So we will do the shopping for you. We do not mind doing that. So you can do either one or you can do a monetary donation and we'll go shopping that night. And you guys do shopping lists for the kids, right? Yes, so all the caseworkers are out right now as we speak doing wish lists with the kids. Those are turned in to me and then we get together, the Taylor County Child Welfare Board and myself, and we match them with the sponsors. And then I send out all the wish lists um, and then I plan on having all those out on November 3rd. And then they can go shopping. And then December 10th is the day they drop them off with us. Then we ask that they are in um, bags, unwrapped for safety purposes. And we also make sure that each kid has the same amount, so it's equal. Absolutely, so y if you can only afford to buy just one thing for child in need this year, uh, that would be perfect, right? Absolutely. Um, and you guys, if it's you're buying one thing for a sibling and the child has other siblings as well, you're making sure they're all getting equal, right? Absolutely and uh, you can do this many ways, right? Mm -hmm. um, and we'll have a link to on our website for all of this as well, but you're really making a difference in these kids' lives, right? I think so. I have been the caseworker to drop them off and those kiddos are at my car door before I even open my car door. <laughs> so it really, is, it really is very special, something that I've always enjoyed doing and being part of every year. Absolutely. Well, ladies, thank you both for joining me. You're doing an absolutely amazing thing here in the big yes. country, and I wish you guys uh, all the best of luck. And if you would like to help with this year's Miracle on Vine Street, the deadline to sign up is Friday, October 20th, but they do say that if you uh, turn one in a little bit later, that will be quite all right. And lists will go out tentatively Friday, November 3rd, and drop-off will be Sunday, December 10th. We'll have details on how you can sign up on our website, bigcountryhomepage.com.